Okay, so this is a quick video on how to make oxtails in an electric skillet. As you see here, I got them bad boys washed already and we're getting them seasoned up. We're going to start with a little garlic powder. Of course, slap your mama. This is also a little beef and pork rub right there from Sweet Smoky Joe's. That's always good on any beef or pork. Black pepper is always a must. And as you see, a little salt-free seasoning. Even though we're gonna add some salt, that salt-free seasoning just always adds a little extra some kick to it. And some garlic flavored olive oil. Coat them well and you're good to go. All-purpose flour. Take your all-purpose flour, sprinkle it on top, or as they say, dust it lightly. Dust your meat, make sure you cover all top, bottom, all sides of it if you can. Mix it up well, and yes, I'm using my sink. My sink has been pre-cleaned. Yes, it has, doing it old school style. Easy cleanup afterwards. Just spray, rinse, and clean. Little bleach sink is clean as new. But back to the meat. Cover all four sides. Get your meat after it's sprinkled, dust it lightly with the flour. Put it in a lightly oiled skillet on medium heat. As you see, get it in there. Try to fit it in the bottom of the pot. Cover the bottom of, I'm sorry, skillet. Cover the bottom of your skillet. Brown it nicely. Let it brown on one side just to get it caramel, caramelized and brown. Keep turning it. The key is to keep turning it. Turn it, turn it, turn it. Brown and turn. Brown and turn. After you get that caramel color as you see here, Mm, I can smell them already. They smell so good. You can smell all your seasonings. All right, now you have that nice brown caramel color on all your meat. It's not going to be cooked all the way through at this point. Have some julienne onions. You can get a cup of water, more than a cup, actually about two cups, enough to fill your meat. Here you can use beef broth, chicken broth, water, whatever you want to use at this point. I use water because I know my seasonings are on point. But if you don't season heavily like I do, you can use beef broth. And again, make sure you have that caramelized color on both sides before you add your liquid. Add your liquid to the skillet. You can also do this in a pot, a crock pot, but today we're using an electric skillet. Cover your meat with the water. Turn it down. I mean, turn it up. I'm sorry. Turn it up on high heat just to get a nice rolling boil. Cover them bad boys up and let them do their thing. They will cook up nice and brown. Once they cook up nice and brown, you can add your onions. You can add carrots, peppers, whatever you want to at this point. I added onions only and then you can turn it back down to a medium heat medium consistency and let them cook a little longer after they have cooked probably a good three hours then there you go you have it nice and tender and just about falling off the bone if you like them to fall off the bone you can cook them a little bit longer I like them just about falling off the bone when I bite into them, they just break apart. That's how I like mine. And there we have it. Oxtails in the electric skillet. Hope you like the recipe. Like and subscribe for more.